Good day everyone, you're watching Radio Fixes. On this video, I'm going to talk about how to disable Microsoft Edge from opening when you start your computer. Now, there are a couple of steps which you need to try to fix the problem. Please make sure to watch this video till the end in case if any of the steps are not working. Now, the first and foremost step, what you need to do is uh, you will have to click on the Start button and then click on Settings. Once you're on the Settings option, you will have to click on Accounts. Once you're on the accounts, then click on sign in option. Once you're on the sign in option uh, under this section, make sure automatically save my restartable apps and restart them when I'm signing back option is being turned off. In case if it is turned on, toggle them and make sure it is being turned off. Now you can try to restart the computer, see if the issue has been resolved. In case if this issue has been not resolved, the next option for you to uh, do is you can go ahead and uh, turn off uh, some of the startup apps for that what you will have to do is you will have to click on the start button again go to settings once you're on the settings you will see an option uh, which says that apps under the apps you will have to click on the startup now this section will show you the uh, apps which are um, enabled to launch on your computer startup so let's say look for microsoft edge if you want to turn off microsoft edge on the startup in case if it is on toggle them and make sure it has been set to turn off in case if you if there are any other apps which needs to be turned off uh, on the startup you can go ahead and turn off under this section so for example if you want to turn off uh, spotify uh, then what you can do is you can toggle them and uh, turn it off so once it is done, try to restart the computer and check if uh, the Microsoft Edge um, launches on the startup. In case if the issue has been fixed, you don't have to go ahead and uh, uh, try the next step. Now the next step, what you will have to do is you will have to turn off the startup boost from the Microsoft Edge. How do you do it? You will have to launch Microsoft Edge on your computer. Click on the um, ellipses or the three dotted lines at the top right corner of uh, the Microsoft Edge. Then click on settings. Once you're on the settings, you can click on system and performances. And check the box which says uh, startup boost on the right hand section and make sure it has been turned off. So that will also stop Microsoft Edge to launch on the startup. In case if all these um, now we can try to restart the computer and check if you are able to uh, if the Microsoft Edge launches on the startup. In case if all these step um, fix a problem, uh, well and good. You don't have to try a next step. The next step for you to do is you will have to go ahead and turn off the Windows Spotlight from your background. So to do that, what you will have to do is you will have to click on the search. Under the search, you can go ahead and type lock screen settings select lock screen settings under this section uh, make sure your personalize your lock screen is being changed from picture or slideshow not from the spotlight now in case if you have a windows spotlight turned on what will happen is there are high chances that the microsoft edge would launch on the startup so in case if this um, Try to restart the computer and see if that fix in case if it fix a problem you don't have to worry you don't um, you can go you can um, uh, you don't have to try the next step in case if all this step doesn't fix a problem the last resort is to uh, go ahead and make some registry changes so for that uh, what you will have to do is uh, you will have to click on the search in this search you will have to type reg edit this will open up the registry editor. In case, if, in case if you get user access control prompt, you may click on yes or continue on the screen. Once you have registry editor open on your computer, um, I would suggest you to make sure that you don't make any unnecessary changes or on your registry editor. In case if you make any unnecessary changes or delete any of the registry keys, there are high chances that your computer might go to a no boot mode. So please be careful while making any registry changes. So once you're on the registry editor, um, navigate to HKey local machine, expand HKey local machine by clicking on this arrow, then expand software. Once you expand software, um, uh, go to the uh, policies once expand policies under policies expand Microsoft now here 
you will have to go ahead and create a new registry key. So what in order to key, create a new registry key, what you will have to do is you will have to do a right click on Microsoft, select Microsoft, do a right click, click on new, select, click on key. Under this section, you can go ahead and name it as Microsoft Edge and hit enter. Once you're on the Microsoft Edge, then you will have to create a new string value and give a name as um, allow pre-launch. So once you have Microsoft Edge, do a right click, click on new, click another key and name it as main. Now, once you're on the main, uh, you will have to select main and do a right click, click on new, select new D word value 32 bit and you will have to go ahead and name it as allow pre-launch a l l o w p r e l a u n c h make sure the naming convention is as is um, how i have typed on the screen i will also put this uh, registry key in the video description you can also uh, pick it up from there and hit enter and double click on it make sure the value is always zero in case if your value is one then you are actually setting the microsoft edge to launch on the startup so make sure it is always set to zero once you have created this registry key the next thing is you will have to go ahead and create another uh, registry key which is called tab preloader so what you will have to do is you will have to go ahead and uh, do a right click click on new and click on key and name it as tab preloader which is t-a-b-p-r-e-l-o-a-d-e-r and uh, hit enter once you have this key then you will have to go ahead and create another uh, d word value you do a right click click on string d word value third a bit and name it as a allow pre allow tab preloading and hit enter double click on it make sure the value has been always set to zero and click on ok so that will go ahead and disable um, microsoft edge to uh, launch microsoft edge on the startup so once you uh, have made this registry entries make sure to restart the computer on the next restart uh, you should not be seeing microsoft edge launching on the startup so this is how you can go ahead and stop Microsoft Edge to launch on the startup. Now, in case if you want to revert the settings back to normal, all you have to do is you will have to go ahead and delete this registry key. Make sure you're deleting the right registry key. Do a right click, click on delete, and that will revert your settings back to normal. So this is how you can go ahead and stop Microsoft Edge on the startup. I hope this video was useful. In case if you like this video, please make sure to hit the like button and do not forget to subscribe to my channel. Thank you. Have a great day.